when I was young, the doctors told my parents that I was brain damaged. That the best I could hope for was being in some home somewhere um, doing peace work, you know, with other retarded or extremely mentally disadvantaged people. Oh, they never, there was never, the doctors didn't have any hope for me ever amounting to anything. And mom and dad kind of took that to heart. I mean, they meant well. They loved me. But all my life, oh, you know, you're brain damaged. You know, you're going to have trouble doing this. Or you can't do this because you're brain damaged. Because, you know, and um, I was in special ed. Most of my early school years, until around middle school, and then I was in special ed math classes. Still can't do math. Make change. My checkbook is a mess. I just, I just can't. I just don't do my numbers. Um, I was diagnosed with dyslexia when I was nine or ten years old, and it took me a long time to learn how to read. I read at a college level now. I just can't do numbers. And um, the main thing is this, this constantly being told I was brain damaged and that I was slow and, and, and being laughed at because I'm a big guy. I was a big kid and I was always behind in the grades. I was always bigger than the other kids. So it was always, oh, he's in the retard class. Look at that big dummy. He's, you know. The other kids, you know, he's stupid. He's in the retard class, and all this, all this stuff, all this baggage. I mean, I'm 63 years old, and I'm still fighting this crap because because it gets into your psyche and it just weighs you down. And um, if I could tell any parent anything, I would tell them that words hurt, and. And be careful how you program your kids. Because I never could keep a job my whole adult life until I became a security guard in Florida. Because in Florida, anybody can be a security guard. And I just wonder what my, how, how my life would have been different if, my, if the programming would have been different. You know, so listen to what you tell yourself and, and listen to what you tell other people because where people seem to rise or, or descend to the level of people's belief in them. People believed I was a stupid, a retard. And it was just, it's just, a, it was just a hell of a thing trying to get over, get over that. So um, I'm not stupid. I'm not brain damaged. I have problems, like anybody else. But everything was made worse by the programming, and that's all I wanted to talk about.